Hi, I'm Andrea Gallo, the director of the Enterprise Group, and uh, we would like to have a short chat with our uh, some of the key team members about the achievements from this week at Linaro Connect in Macau. So we have Ed Neville, Open JDK. Hi. Um, uh, okay. Well, I think one of the key achievements, strangely, was uh, nothing to do with uh, Open JDK. Uh, we actually worked on Hip Hop VM. Uh, we got it building on the ARM V8 hardware and we're going to take that back to Cambridge and we're going to put it in the lab there, get an overnight CI loop running with Hip Hop VM, reporting the, bu the bugs and faults back to the developers. And this will be a huge benefit to the developers because previously they haven't had any access to this hardware, so they'll be able to see faults from their code running on real hardware. Ed, you have just won a very important award. Tell us more about your award. Uh, oh, thank you. Uh, you have to explain what, what most pervasive uh, innovator. Does this mean the person who uh, is the most truculent and uh, gets in the way? Uh, <laughs> the one um, that gets the most in the way? <laughs> I think... Uh, I, d I don't have great technical skills or knowledge, OK? Uh, but what I do have is persistence. So maybe it's pervasive means persistence. <laughs> if I see a problem, I will keep on working at it and working at it until that problem is solved. So that's, I, I, I think, um, my contribution. And we have Leif. Uh, Leif is the tech leader for the UEFI team. And we have got very great achievements in the hacking room. On yeah, so we've been working all week on, I mean, to some extent, most of the things we've achieved this week have been around discussing and standardizing and actually trying to get to a point where we have a proper solid, ready for the enterprise boot architecture on ARM all the way across the firmware up to a bootloader like Grub and Linux running both on directly on hardware but also with the virtualization team working on how to get a standard working for actually running virtual machines in a, in a predefined way. And we have the most smiling and laughing person, <laughs> always good mood, great work, Al Stone. What are you doing, Al, these days? <laughs> <laughs> Drinking heavily. Um, <laughs> coffee, coffee or alcohol? Yes. Both. <laughs> <laughs> so this week we've been working with uh, ACPI, which is a bit of a controversial subject in, the, in our particular neck of the woods. Um, but we've been working on getting that upstream, working with the kernel maintainers, and making an incredible amount of progress in, in getting that done and understanding what it is we need to do next. And um, with the net result being that we'll be able to get uh, to we'll be able to assist life in getting a, a boot architecture that is solid, stable, and enterprise-ready in, in the near future. So that's what we've been doing. And we have also one person with us who has just won the award as the member, the assignee from member company with the biggest impact on Linaro, Han Jun. Yeah, hi. So, you know, I'm so excited and, uh, you know, I had all my wounds and I am I'm mean, just uh, too proud of this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Thank you very much. It has been a great week in Macau. We have not had one single minute out, but we have spent a lot of time all together in the hacking rooms, in the sessions. Thank you very much. <laughs>